Hi all. In this video, we are discussing about OpenHRMS multi-level approval in Order 50. OpenHRMS is a open source HR management software which helps to create happier workspace for employees. Moreover, it is packed with advanced features to manage and act as a solution to run all the HR management operations in your company. So, in this video, we are discussing about OpenHRMS multi-level approval in Order 50. This module extends Odo's default HR holiday management with extra features adaptable for managing employees' holidays with multi-level approvals. So, let's look on that feature. For that, first we need to install the OpenHRMS multi-level approval module from the App Store. OpenHRMS leave multi-level approval, which of technical name OHRMS holidays approval. Once we install this module, you would be able to access this feature. For get that feature, let's look on to the leaves module. So insert the leaves module under the configuration for the time of types. At here, we can choose one time off. I'm just choosing paid time off. Currently for this paid time off, its approval is set as by the employee's approver and time off officer. So when we install this module, you can see one more feature is added for this approval. That is multi-level approval. When I enable the multi-level approval, a new tab will get it here. That is leave validation. Here we can add the leave validators. So I added two users, Mark Demo and Michelle Admin, who are the two users inside my demo database. And then save the time of type. Then try to create a new leave request with of this time paid time off so i'm going to the dashboard and from may 2 to 4 i just creating a paid time off and automatically when we choose the time off as paid time off uh, the leave uh, a new tab will be created here that is validation status with of the leave validators that we added inside the configuration of time of type and then just save the record then uh, the Michelle admin who is one of the leave validator. So I go to the approvals menu and insert the time off. I got that Michelle admin. So at here, the Michelle admin will be shown here. So I am just approving the Michelle admin's request. So insert the validation status tab, we can see the approve status of Michelle admin is enabled. Whereas it doesn't enable the doesn't so the mark demo user doesn't approve the leave request that's why it shows as empty and the approve button is still existed here so i am logging as a demo user so at here i am logging as a mark demo user then goes to the leave module then in the time off so at here we can see the leave request that oh, pay with the paid time off of michel admin which is need to approve by the mark demo. So the mark demo is approved and which move to approved status. And then here for the approved status of mark demo is also validated. Likewise, we can add different, different le uh, level of approvals in the configuration of time of type, which helps to give a double or multi-level approval system in our form. That's all about the feature of OHRMS multi-level approval in Order 15. Thank you for watching the video. If you want to know more details about OpenHRMS, you can visit openhrms.com.